Hello, today we are going to draw an oval given its major axis AB. The first step is to divide the axis AB into three equal parts using Tails theorem. To do this, we are going to draw a line starting from point A of our line segment AB at any angle as shown here in the video. Now, using our compass, which we will set to a certain length, 4 centimeters, for example. And we will proceed to scribe three arcs on this line using the compass as shown here in the video, as we want to divide our segment into three equal parts. It's the second arc, and here's the third. When we have scribed our third arc, we are now going to join this point to point B on the line segment AB as shown here. And from now on, we will draw parallel segments to the previous junction as shown in the video through successive marks drawn above previously. Draw our third parallel line. These parallel lines will intersect our line segment AB at two points which we will call C and D. So the next step is we are going to draw two circles centered on the points C and D with a radius AC for both circles. So now with our compass set on point C and radius AC we will draw our first circle. And now setting our compass on point D with the same radius, we will draw our second circle. These two circles intersect at two new points, which we will call E and F, as can be seen here. Now we are going to draw a line starting from point F, going through point C, elongating until it cuts the circle at a new point, which we will call G, as can be seen here. And continuing, we will draw a line from point F through point D until it cuts our circle at a new point, which we will call H. And again, we draw a line starting from point E through point D until it cuts our circle at a new point, I. And finally, we will draw a line from point E through point C until it cuts our circle at our final tangent point, which we will call J. The next step, we are going to draw the first two arcs of the oval. First, first one centered in point D and radius DB. We join points H to I in a thicker line, as can be seen here. Now, with our compass set on point C and radius CA, we join points J to G in a thicker line again, as shown here. And now we are going to draw the last two arcs of our oval. First, setting our compass on point F and radius FG, we join points G to H, which are the tangent points. And now, setting our compass on point E and radius EJ, we join the last two tangent points J to I.
So here we have our oval given its major axis AB. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please press like or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Until the next time.